hello guys welcome back to my channel thank you for always stopping by liking commenting and subscribing for the new ones don't forget to like comment subscribe turn on the notification bell so that you'll be notified on when i drop updates on rather mohan stay tuned mohan reminds ketke that she insulted ajit family so much she asked him to not divert the topic that she knows he doesn't want wrong to happen with her and rather and she knows mohan loves rather he tells he doesn't kaveri says mohan loves damini Ketke asks her to not interfere in the family matter. Mohan tells Ketke she can't interfere in the family matter too. Tusi tells Mohan he's hurting his loved ones instead of searching for Radha and asks him to understand it's Damini and Kaveri's old game. Ketke tells Mohan she and Ajit will go to search for Radha no matter what. Mohan says he would cut off all ties with the people who goes to search for Radha. Gungun says she would go with Ketke. Mohan asks Gungun to stop it. Kadambari comes in and asks Mohan to stop it. Radha apologizes to Gungun for failing to protect herself, recalls the moment she shared with them and loses consciousness. Kadambari tells Mohan that Radha is in danger for sure. Mohan tells Radha is doing all this to bring him to the office. Kadambari asks if he is going to say same after something happened to Radha. Kaveri tells Damini they should have sent Kadambari also to the cold storage. Damini says she won't give easy death to Kadambari but now her priority is Radha. Mohan tells Kadambari nothing would happen to Radha because everything is Radha's drama. Tusi gets glimpses of blood and gets worried about Radha. She holds an up church chain and gets glimpses of Radha lying on the floor and sees Radha moving towards afterlife and asks Radha to stop that she can't go because Radha has to save Trividis from Damini and Radha is her last hope. She holds Radha's hand. Gungun asks Mohan to go with her to search for Radha because she's not doing any drama. Kadambari tells Mohan he won't be able to forgive himself if anything happens to Radha. Mohan tells that he won't go to search for Radha. Damini says Mohan is right. Ketki scolds her for coming between Radha and Mohan. Gungun asks them to stop fighting and says they have to search for Radha. Mohan tells them no one should go to search for Radha and goes inside. Gungun tells Ketki she is telling the truth. Ketki assures they would find Radha. Tusi tells Radha she can't die. Radha gets shocked seeing Tusi and asks how she can touch and recalls how Tusi said she can't touch others. Tusi tells Radha this is a place between life and death and Radha has to return to her life. The Mohan and Gungun's life begins and ends with Radha and she knows Mohan loves Radha and would die if he loses Radha. Then that. Gungun needs Radha. She pleads with her to not leave Mohan and Gungun and notices blood on Radha's head. Damini and Kaveri celebrate their sources. Damini tells Kaveri she loved it when Mohan went against Radha and Gungun and they will start hating Mohan after learning of Radha's death that she will handle Mohan when he becomes alone. She plans to send Gungun to a hostel. Gungun apologizes to Mohan for troubling him and says she's not lying this time. Kadambari tells Mohan even her heart is saying Radha is in danger. Mohan says they saw the CCTV footage, how Radha left the office and everything is Radha and Gungun's plan to bring him to the office. Radha tells Tusi she won't get another chance like this and asks her to tell the truth of her death. Tusi asks Radha to say where she is now because she is bleeding. Radha asks Tusi what happened with her, that she wants to know the truth of her death. Tusi recalls her death, notices light coming to take Radha. Radha starts moving towards the light. Tusi asks Radha to stop. Mohan tells Kadambari everything is Radha and Gungun's plan. She tells him Radha won't do anything like this. He tells Radha can stoop any load to reach her goal. That Radha must be hiding somewhere near the office and Gungun must be showing live telecast of all this to Radha. She asks him to search for Radha for her sake. He refuses and asks why Radha's phone is switched off when she charges her phone always to talk to Gungun. She tells Gungun is worried. He tells her all this drama will soon end and Radha will return. Rahu wonders where Damin and Kaveri are. Tusi tells Radha she won't let her go and says Mohan and Gungun won't be able to live without her. Wonders how to stop Radha and recalls the moment Radha shared with Mohan and Gungun and shows their photos to her and asks her to die after crossing this photo. Radha turns around. Tusi tells Radha she could not enter the light due to Mohan but her body got burnt completely. That's why she could not enter her body and Radha has this time to return to her body. She asks her to survive and fulfill her responsibilities. That Mohan and Gungun loves her so she can't die like this. Radha gets emotional seeing Mohan and Gungun's photo. Recalls the moment she shared with them. Tusi says Mohan and Gungun will be heartbroken if she dies. She asks if she can break their hearts that they need her. She says she can't go, cries hugging the photos. Tusi says Radha has to leave for Gungun and Mohan. Mohan tells Ketke to, to give food to Gungun. Gungun tells Radha knows she won't eat without her and she never misses to give medicines to Mohan. Still, Radha is not there because she's in danger. Mohan asks her to not talk like an adult. Gungun tells he did not change and reminds him how Radha saved him always. Tells him that she won't talk to him if anything happened to Radha. He tells she can do whatever she wants to do. Everyone gets shocked hearing him. He goes to have food. Radha struggles to not enter the light. Tusi says she also went through this pain. Tusi tells Radha to not leave the photo until she 
returns, reminds her she has to leave for Gungun and Mohan and asks her to tolerate the pain and not leave. Father promises to not leave. Tusi leaves from there. Father recalls the moment she shared with Mohan and Gungun and also how they took stand for her. Tusi reaches the house and asks Lord Krishna why he's separating Radha from Mohan and Gungun. That after a long time, Mohan and Gungun got happiness and Lord Krishna want to snatch their happiness. And asks what kind of game this is and why Radha is in this condition. Radha recalls how Mohan asked her to leave from his life and never return. She holds the photo slightly tightly and says Mohan won't be able to forgive himself if anything happened to her, that Mohan would blame himself for her death. She pleads Lord Krishna to let her stay with her family and says Lord Krishna can do anything so she should not separate her from Mohan and Gungun. She chants mantras of Lord Krishna. Tusi orders Lord Krishna to return happiness to her family, that Lord Krishna has to prove ro that wrong doesn't happen to its good people and she would blame him if anything happened to Radha. She asks him to change Radha's destiny because Radha can't die.